Hello, everybody. Welcome to the show. I'm your host, David Burroughs, and this is episode number 63. Are you ready? Are you ready? Well, hello, and once again, and as always, thanks for taking the time to stop on by here on the show. Got some really fun things lined up for you, as always. But just before we get started, I just want to uh, make a suggestion. Let me get this out here. Do you have one of these? Yes, it's a cell phone, smartphone, and it has a video camera built right into it. So here's what I'm suggesting to all of you. While I can't be everywhere with the show camera, you are all out there. So take the time. If you're at a special event or you're watching your favorite band or something exciting's happening, Take the time to take some video. Keep it no more than a minute long and send it to me here at the show at davidburrows.ws. And when I receive it, I'll do whatever I can to get it on the next show. Also, don't forget, every Wednesday the show comes out and is now featured at k106fm.com. And every Wednesday morning about 11.30, I join Rob Jenkins down at k106fm and talk to you about what's happening that week on the show. So be sure to tune in every Wednesday about 11.30 when I join my friend Rob Jenkins at k106fm.com or right on the radio at k106.3fm. All right, well, Super Bowl fans, you got to be getting excited. It's been a great football season, a lot of fun so far. And, of course, the biggest part of it all, Super Bowl is going to be happening. And this year, they are promising the biggest Super Bowl party ever to hit Sarnia. Here is a very special message from Brownstone's Sports Bar and Lounge. Don't miss this. <laughs> now that's something you don't see every day, folks. A cat using a human toilet. I can't stand these videos. And I can't stand you, Kelly. Coming up next, we're gonna talk about the old Brownstone Super Bowl party. Wrong as usual, Tim. There's nothing old about it. It's the first one, and it's going to be incredible. Kelly, I'm gonna stop you right there. Once again, thanking you for embarrassing me on TV. As always, my mom is watching. Good morning, Mom. <laughs> $15 ticket and that covers our amazing American style buffet, lots of great prize, like lots of great prize giveaways, great stuff. Very professional, well spoken and eloquent Kelly, but yes, lots of Budweiser giveaway prizes, some trivia, of course a chance for fans to gather on the biggest TV in Sarnia, I'm talking about the Brownstones 10x6 video wall. Of course Tim, now as you know, I don't get out anymore. Well that's not what the techie sent me last night at 3 in the morning said, by the way my girlfriend saw it and it has to stop. <laughs> So, Brownstones is going big this year. Well put, Kelly. I think a three-second dance party is in order, don't you? Sounds good. So we'll see everybody February 3rd for the biggest Super Bowl party in town at Brownstones. But first, a dog who uses a cell phone. You're useless, Tim, and I hate you. Why are you doing this to me? All right, well, there you have Brownstones promising the biggest Super Bowl party ever to hit Sarnia. And, of course, their big 10 by 6 foot video wall and lots of televisions throughout the room. Great food and going to be some great fun and some huge, great prizes happening down there. Get your tickets in advance. You can stop down to Brownstones to get those tickets. Only $15 once again. And we're looking forward to being down there with a show camera to show you some behind the scenes of what's going to happen down there. Brownstones for Super Bowl. That's coming up February the 3rd. All right, well, some local fighters, MMA fighters, if you will. We cover that once in a while. Woodrow James. Yes, Woody James, and if you know him, he hasn't fought in about three, three and a half years. He has been one of the promoters here in Sarnia for the big MMA events that occur. But he's decided to step back into the cage, as well as another newcomer to the cage. Uh, we're going to talk to both of these gentlemen right now. So take a look at this interview with Woodrow James and Patrick McInnes, and then we'll be back for more. All right, well, we've got a very special interview once again returning for us here. He's been here before, Woodrow James. How you doing, Woody? I'm doing good, Dave. How are you? you got some really exciting things coming up here. February the 9th over in Michigan. Um, this guy, I've heard of him. Woody's fighting. Is that you? <laughs> yeah. It's been uh, three years, and I'm decided to make a little bit of a comeback. Yeah? It's good, it's good for my health. Yeah? Is that what, what made you decide to do it, though? Like, I mean, three and a half years away, uh, you've been busy promoting. Why come back in a cage? Well, this is amateur. What you've worked with me in the past has been professional. I'm right. obviously not at that level. Okay. Um, I run amateur shows in Michigan, and I have a three-year-old son. I quit. I kind of took some time off right sure. before he was born, focused on that. I was going through some things right. in life, injuries, and I, I kept training. 
You know yeah. what I mean? I've had John in my corner for a long right. time, and we still were in here running, running the classes and everything, and it was just time to come back. I'm yeah. feeling good in shape. Injuries are low, and it's good for well, my health. Well, you were sweating pretty hard when I came in here. I've never seen you sweat so hard before. I'm glad you didn't film them, <laughs> kick, them kicking my butt here on camera. So where is this happening? Uh, it's going to be at the Knights of Columbus Hall over on Dove Street okay. and Braden Port Huron. It's in the industrial area. We're getting, it's going to be $20 at the door. It's February 9th. Doors open at 7 p.m. Okay. Look us up on Facebook. It's uh, Amateur Fight Club, AFC. Or, or add me on Facebook with right. Joe James. Yeah, okay, we'll put that all up on the screen. We'll, uh, good luck to you in your fight. Uh, somebody else is going to be fighting down there, Patrick McInnes. Yeah, we're having our, uh, our young, young student making his debut. He, yeah, uh, we're going to, yeah, let's get him in here right now. Come on in. Woody, good luck to your fight there. Thanks, man. And, uh, we'll, we'll see you guys February night. Yeah, for sure. Patrick McKinnis coming in here. How are you, Patrick? Good, thank you. Yeah, this is your, your uh, an exciting fight for you. Tell us why. Uh, it'll be my first MMA fight, actually, so I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, and uh, you're, you're going to be, who are you fighting? Do we know what's happening there yet? Um, I don't even know my opponent's name yet. Um, Woody should know. He's, yeah, okay. the, he's the one to tell me that. Well, we'll find out about all that. What have you been doing for your training? Uh, just training really, training really hard. Uh, four times a week with these guys. Uh, sparring today was pretty hard. So, yeah. are you are you combination excited, nervous? Uh, yes, I am. It's my first MMA fight, so I'm pretty nervous, but I'm looking forward to it. I've had four boxing fights and a kickboxing fight, so. Right. Got some ring experience. So. Awesome. Well, you've definitely got the right team backing you up, and uh, it sounds like uh, you're going to do well over there. So good luck to you, Patrick. Awesome. Thank you. And we'll follow up with you. Thank you. Once again, down here with Team Supreme MMA, and we're going to be talking more about their show coming up over in Michigan. Keep watching the show for more. All right, well, Woody, congratulations on your comeback fight, if you will. Good luck to you. And Patrick McInnes, we wish him all the best as well for his debut fight over in Port Huron. Congratulations, guys, and we'll look forward to uh, following up with you to see how you make out. All right, got to take a really quick break. Some really special messages here. And then when we come back, we've got some more exciting stuff for you. Don't go away. All right, welcome back once again here on the show. We're going to change the genre up a little bit. We do uh, a lot of country and rock and roll and, and that sort of different kind of thing. But uh, right now, we're going to take you to some hip-hop. A local hip-hop artist, Taylor Cassidy, or T-Cass, he's known for, just came out recently with the latest of one of his videos. And uh, I was very impressed with the uh, video quality work. Local gentleman, Ian Alexander, put this together for TCAS and uh, well it's a really cool video so take the time to watch this very special video from TCAS Taylor Cassidy here from Sarnia Ontario and then we'll be back with even more for you here in the show I'm a champion been through some trouble some trouble some trouble some trouble, some trouble, some trouble. Watch my mom struggle so much. Make your purchase now. now. I'm a champion, went through some trouble and had to handle it. Watch my mom struggle so much. It was damaging, wishing I could give her it all. Like the man I am, proving everybody else wrong. She reached a champion, champion. All that I need is my family in. All that I can say to the world is keep on smiling. If you feel like breathing from the top of your lungs, scream, I'm a champion. I'm a I watch my mother struggle day and night to raise four kids I want you to know how much I appreciate the things that you did All the time spent wondering are we all gonna make it And late nights I'd hear her crying cause she can't make a payment And rent's late, she's trying to put hot food on her plate But at the same time raise us with a smile and face You hold your struggle inside, please mama it's gonna be fine Sometimes I wonder would it be better if I wasn't around Like is this all just a dream but my mother raised me to see Positive in the most negative Negative situations, that's why you see me smiling on a day to day basis. I'm trying to give my family everything they deserve. It's for my nieces and nephews so that they don't have to worry when everyone's a fall down. You just can't walk away. It takes a man to help them up, and well, that's just how I was raised. So let it be told. My mama's better than bronze or silver, she's gold. I'm a champion, been through some trouble and had to handle it. Watch my mom struggle so much. It was damaging, wishing I could give her it all. Like the man I am, proving everybody else. She raised a 
champion, champion All that I need is my family again All that I can say to the world is keep on smiling If you feel like leaving from the top of your lungs Scream, I'm a champion, I'm a champion Now picture this, my mama ballin' hard like Jordan I married someone who's successful like a doctor, a lawyer Imagine my family understanding how to listen and learn Instead of taking everything that our mama had earned Cause time is priceless and every single day is a gift My mother raised us with a conscience we would all change the world Taught me to stay humble and show respect No matter how mad I get Real men never ever hit girls So now it don't I'm living in this life alone I think about the old days as I move along strong I try to keep my head up to prove a point to myself like my mama raising four kids, she ain't need no one's help I can never repay you for all the things that you've done People talk, let them say what they want You're still my number one So before I'm dead and gone Want you to know I love you, mommy You didn't fail, you raised a champion I'm a champion, been through some trouble And had to handle it Watch my mom struggle so much It was damaging, wishing I could give her it all Like the man I am, proving everybody else wrong She raised a champion, champion All that I need is my family and all that I can say to the world is keep on smiling If you feel like leaving from the top of your lungs Scream I'm a champion I'm a champion Scream I'm a champion Been through some trouble and had to handle it Watched my mom struggle so much It was damaging Wishing I could give her it all Like the man I am Proving everybody else wrong She raised a champion Champion All that I need Is my family in All that I can say to the world Is keep on smiling If you feel like me Then from the top of your lungs Scream I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a champion, been through some trouble and had to handle it Watch my mom struggle so much, it was damaging Wishing I could give her it all, like the man I am Proving everybody else wrong, else wrong I'm a champion, been through some trouble and had to handle it Watch my mom struggle so much, it was damaging Wishing I could give her it all, like the man I am Proving everybody else wrong She raised a champion, champion, all that I need is my family in all that I can say to the world is keep on smiling If you feel like me then from the top of your lungs Scream I'm a champion, I'm a champion Scream I'm a champion, been through some trouble and had to handle it Watch my mom struggle so much, it was damaging Wishing I could give her it all, like the man I am Proving everybody else wrong She raised a champion, champion, all that I need Is my family in all that I can say to the world is keep on smiling If you feel like me then from the top of your your lungs scream, I'm a champion I'm a champion Scream, I'm a champion Been through some trouble and had to handle it Watch my mom struggle so much It was damaging Wishing I could give her it all Like the man I am Proving everybody else wrong She raised a champion Champion All that I need Is my family in All that I can say to the world Is keep on smiling If you feel like me Then from the top of your lungs Scream, I'm a champion I'm a champion Once again, Taylor Cassidy there for you, TCAS, as he's better known as. Thanks for allowing us to share that, TCAS. And very special thank you also to Ian Alexander, who uh, put that video together for TCAS. Very well done. All right, well, I got to tell you, uh, got downtown over the past week and got down to some of my old roots, if you will, formerly Mr. Mike's, now known as Liquid Johnny's, putting on the blues theme as well as some rock and roll and uh, bringing back some of the old guys, I like to say, and I uh, mean that with all due respect. This past Thursday, I got down to Liquid Johnny's. The Stud Brothers are there every Thursday night, and uh, they were pouring it on with local artist Ronnie Frey was joining them down there, and I just so happened to get down there, and Mark Blaney showed up and a few others as well, so it really turned out to be a really cool night, and I was glad to be there and get some footage. So check this out, the new Liquid Johnny's right now with the Stud Brothers, Ronnie Frey and Mark Blaney. Watch this.
what an awesome time. I tell you, I wish I had uh, time to show you all the footage that I got there, but I'm saving it in the archives for uh, future shows, if you will. Ronnie Frey, Stutt Brothers, and even Mark Blaney jumped in there. Thanks so much, guys, for allowing me to take that footage and share it here on the show. All right, one more quick break, and then I'll be back to wrap up the show with some exciting events coming soon to Sarnia. Check this out. Cheeky Monkey, the greatest TV store. Cheeky Monkey, movies and more. Cheeky Monkey, the greatest TV store in town. Cheeky Monkey, the greatest TV store in town. Welcome back one final time here on the show, and thanks Cheeky Monkey for all your support here on the show and for all that you do to support local talent here in Sarnia. Be sure to check them out online at CheekyMonkeySarnia.ca. All right, just a few special events happening this weekend. First, we start off Friday night down at Bottoms Up Bar and Grill in Point Edward. Powerhouse will be down there, so if you're an 80s rock fan, you're going to want to get down and check out the Powerhouse band down at Bottoms Up here in Point Edward. Also, coming up Saturday night down at the Stubborn Mule, a very special benefit for the family of Joanne Underhill, whose life was taken away from us here in this past September. And now they're raising some money to help the children out that were left behind. She leaves behind three children. And uh, get down there. It's going to be a rocking good night because Scott Maneering, the Barn Burners, Third Wave, and Blind Dog Molly putting in their efforts to help raise money for this great cause. Tickets only $10. That's this Saturday night down at the Stubborn Mule. Also, Sunday afternoon, if you're looking for some fun and casual karaoke, I like to call it, stop down and see me at Rock and Roll Pool Hall, located down by the beer store here on Maxwell Street. We always have a great time. Free meat raffle, and even if you don't sing, just hang out with us and have a good time. That starts Sunday from 3 till 7 down at the Rock and Roll Pool Hall here in Sarnia. All right, well, that's all the time I got for you. Be sure to stay tuned because we're going to have some more events coming up every week for you, so don't miss it. And if you want to be here on the show, send me an email to the show at davidburrows.ws. And remember, as I mentioned earlier, get those video phones out. Take me some video footage of where you are during the week, on the weekend, whatever, and send it to me here. Once again, that email, the show at davidburrows.ws. That's all the time I got for you this week. Have a great week and an even better weekend. We'll see you next time right here on the show. Bye for now.